What's up, what's up guys, your boy Silencio, and welcome to another video. This video is gonna be us talking about what happened in 2022 and what's to come in 2023. First of all, happy new years and happy and merry Christmas, happy holidays, all that good stuff for you guys. Um, I've been away, and this video is to let you guys know that I didn't forget, I haven't uploaded in days, but it's because um, I've been sick and um, slowly recovering and I'm be able to come back with some videos which i have in mind uh, i do have some summonings videos that i gotta do and you know all that good christmas ending stuff and then new year stuff that's here to come so this year oh when i say 2022 was a bit of a roller coaster when it comes to games right for one that's when we found out about beachy motor souls being staled Yes, we know they've been stale for a while, but I mean like completely stale because of featured characters not released since, since May of 2022. And then we started opening our eyes more about what the game is going to bring, blah, blah, blah. I have a video about that some other time, breaking down what, what to expect. The screen you see right now is uh, my tablet, which for every game I have, I'm playing right now is here. Uh, this All the games I still play and somewhat do contact to. What I mean by that is like, like Sword Art Online is it's just been one of the upcoming games for me and then let me down. The beta was okay, laggy and all that stuff. I was expecting them to improve. They improved a little bit. Still not a game that I will put like up there. So it's probably a game I will replace down the line. The way I feel like it's like my hero, uh, Ultra Impact, as strongest hero, like I had fun. But it's just that it was getting so hard to continue that I had to move on. So that's one of the games. Sadly about that. And then we go to the left, we see Fumero Alchemist, which is right there. Fumero Alchemist uh, started rough for me. Uh, it's still my top three favorite anime of all time. When it comes to story and, and all that good stuff. Um, I love that game. I love the anime to death, the characters and all that. Uh, that game has a lot of potential what drew what dragged me down about the game was the fact that uh i guess the summoning the summoning was so bad that featured all um rates was not even there and you think it's there the only thing that really worked was the step up because you are guaranteed to have the character and by the end and even so you need i think a total of four of them for dupes to get them at least use, usable in the game it's kind of a, of, of a drag and what got everybody pissed off even big youtuber pissed off and the first collaboration with persona 5 i believe so if i'm not mistaken uh they had they made it pay to win you couldn't use your uh tokens to summon which is like mind-blowing you could have all those diamonds you couldn't convert them to tokens so it's, it kind of pissed people off and they hope, you know, people should still waiting to see what they're going to do next. It is what it is. The game is still up in the air for me. I still do content for them. I still do, you know, a play every day. Whatever. The one left next to it, the fairy tale one. Not the newer one. The the one that I, I think, what was it, August it came out? September? I don't remember exactly the date. So that game is definitely a pay to win game. Um, it, it, for, it, for me, it's just hanging there. Until they decide to change things. I have so much diamonds there, but I can't use it because um, there's a limit to how many, uh, what is it called? I think the tickets, how many red tickets you can buy a day, which is fucking stupid. There was no limit. I would have at least probably a thousand tickets by now. Probably exaggerating, but you know what I mean? So that game is definitely worst game right now to play aside from all of them. And I know. I think 60% of these games you see here, they are overseas. They're not global. It, yeah, yeah, I get it. You have Eminence, which was uh, a, a turnoff for me because uh, Eminence, I expected a lot from this game. And and I started even watching the anime because of this game. I wanted a new game to come out. And again, I was just kind of disappointed how the drop rates are and how they're constantly releasing banners. Left and right, you're like, can't even give us a break. 
uh, enough from the, uh, from from all that. Whatever. And then we have Shaman King, which is still one of my top games to play right now. Shaman King. I wish it comes out global because definitely Shaman King is definitely uh there, and uh, and I'm hoping that it does release. We already ready past the one year anniversary, so let's just hope for that. Let's not talk about Immortal Souls right now because honestly, that's a different conversation. The one next to it is the uh what's it called i forgot the name of uh, slayer okay realm slayer bleach realm sam so you guys know that the uh, um arc finished their first season so we should be expecting this specific game to pick up soon uh we still haven't have all the captains there yet it's definitely on the slow pace it did come out in august so we have to like give it some time and we don't get it says season two till uh july of of this year so we're gonna start seeing characters there soon and then that same conversation goes with motor souls which i don't want to talk about it yet but we'll, we'll have that conversation in a different video uh we still ha i still have um soul bankire around here which is here this is the game that i definitely don't go you see black hole over there it's chilling there because that's the beta i want to see whatever happens to that beta you have harry potter there too talk about that in a few we have um, Soul Bankai there. I ha they haven't done anything new yet, so I don't know what's going on with them. It is what it is. One Punch Man. Been playing this game. I didn't think I was going to enjoy it as much, but here I am enjoying it. So I love this game. So definitely there to make content. I just I, I feel so behind. I'm trying to play the catch-up game because I know um, that's pretty much what games are when you're years behind. We have the new Fairy Tale, which I'm digging. Uh, but not a hundred percent yet. Uh, still haven't completely be like, okay, this is definitely a, a one of the games of the year. No, it's uh, it still needs some work. Still doesn't drag me to it. And then we have uh, other new games that was announced. It's coming out in twenty twenty three, which is amazing. So what I'm trying to say is that for for twenty twenty three, uh, my goal is to change things up a bit. Uh, we'll be doing videos for these games. Uh, when it's uh prior like like summonings events seasonal whatever the case is uh but most of them i might do live streams uh if one day i don't post a video it because i will be replaced with live stream because go the algorithm works when you do shorts when you do videos when you do live stream they all have their own algorithm so you don't like to have them stacked up too much have their space so they can be able to go into the system and get you know push out so um I used to do double uploads a lot and might stop that a bit. If I do double uploads, it might be with shorts. Well, I'll still be able to give you guys shorts, like a 1v1 fights and stuff like that. But live stream, yes. And um, that's when um, Harry Potter comes in. Uh, we'll be diving in again, Harry Potter, because they did announce it coming out this year. I'll dive in, doing some little contests for Harry Potter live stream until the global release. Any other major... Uh, um events that happen in these games i'll live stream it and also some other games i would like to live stream when it comes to anime and stuff like that if you guys have any games in, you know, in mind you guys would like me to live stream uh, let me know in the comments but i'm trying to implement more live stream i did it a lot in the beginning of my youtube and i stopped because um the motor soap is getting really pissed off i won't i'm gonna bring it back but yes in motor souls live stream will be coming back too um, there's still extreme challenges that I have not finished. Uh, we like to live stream and just vibe a bit. Um, not care much. Doesn't care how the, what people think about the game is dying. I don't care about that. I just want to relax, have fun. And you guys, the community, you guys will make this channel what it is. So I will be trying to do stuff like that because doing the copy and paste, rinse and repeat of videos every month, every week, every year, um, it doesn't show progress. And I love when it comes to progress. I love changing stuff. If it's equipment, if it's um, thumbnails, if it's stuff like that, I like changing stuff ab around just to get a different crowd, a different mindset. So that's my goal for 2023 is to give you guys um, live streams, at least two or three a, a week. Uh, I have the equipment, I have stuff. I just haven't, I have, do have a second channel, which I do live stream. I'm gonna change stuff over there too. But this is my main channel, and this is where I'm going to be doing most of the stuff. More in interaction with you guys, because I feel like we have, uh, you know, spaced out a bit. 
and I don't like that and so I will be changing that a bit so you guys will be expecting a lot of live streams um, I just got to figure out what kind of games I want to implement because this channel has become an anime related live stream I mean channel not live stream anime anime related gacha base channel and I don't want to change it from that that's why I don't bring any other different games into here unless you know that's what you guys want because in the end it's, it's what you guys want not what I want I play what I want and I'll just drag this channel to the ground you know what I mean that's the thing about when it comes to YouTube you have to play whatever's popular whatever is gets the, the the numbers right if not then you're just gonna be playing for fun and that's just gonna crash the whole thing Nobody wants that. And obviously, when more games come out, I will be live streaming those games. Like Black Clover come out, Jujutsu Kaisen comes out. Uh, I saw a uh, One Punch Man Worlds coming out, which is a live uh, open world. Hunter and Hunter's open world coming out too. I will be live streaming those. Those open world type of games definitely are good to live stream. So yeah, expect that from 2023 uh, live streams and um, interact with you guys. Time wise. I know that I have a whole bunch of fan base uh, overseas, so that's gonna be a tough one to to narrow down what what's what's the best time to do this. But I'll do my best because regardless, it become a video. You guys could always go back and watch it. Uh, I'll try to difference the time, like do it early, then do it late, and just see how everything goes. But yeah, changes are never bad, always good. You never know what you know changes could bring and um i want to bring good changes for you guys and for myself uh involve myself more with you guys and get involved give it a chat and see what you guys are thinking about um and um and have a blast you know i'm not worried about the numbers i'm just more worried about connecting with you guys more and see what you guys thinking about and all that stuff so i'm you know the comments is open down below you guys have any suggestion of games you guys want me to live stream or oh, oh actually animes you guys want me to try out shit well i would just jump in to do nothing just talk to you guys about releases about life about everything it doesn't really matter to me it's just having a good time that's what 2023 is going to be about having a good time leaving the bs behind no drama good vibes like i got always um preach and that's what it's basically about so these are the games i'm playing and um some games will be replaced because i'm waiting for the best games to come out in 2023 because 2022 was not the best year for it so yeah uh, again sorry for delays sorry for not posting much i know i have two um uh, anime videos like the bleach ones two vi two episodes that i haven't done yet anyway, which i will be doing i know i'm gonna be super late but this is what it is. Um, this is just mostly for me. I love doing those. So I will be posting those. And um, and down the line, maybe more uh, anime breakdowns comes out that I want to do. And I'll do it. And yeah. Again, happy New Year's. Happy holidays. Uh, hope you guys all enjoy your New Year's with your family, with your friends. Hope you guys enjoyed or ha and have everything that's what you guys wanted and stuff like that and soon we'll be live streaming with you guys and having a good time so stay tuned for that when will we start i have no idea yet i still got to play the catch-up game when it comes with these videos because i've been sick and i'm very behind so i'll be doing these videos for you guys and posting them so you guys could understand what's going on next and i hope you guys understand that i'm trying my best and um, i will continue to improve in all content and all stuff to connect with you guys because you guys saw the priority not me and yeah let's have fun so anyways guys thanks for watching make sure you like subscribe and let me know down below what you guys think as always i will see you guys in the next video peace out